वेलकम बैक टू इन फिज्ञान माई डियर फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो विल बी सॉल्विंग अनदर वेरी वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम एलजेब्रा एक्स पार फाइव इक्वल टू एक्स माइनस वन होल पार फाइव सो लेट्स गेट इट स्टार्टेड आई विल टेक माइनस वन कॉमन फ्रॉम दिस ब्रैकेट सो आई कैन राइट माइनस वन टाइम्स वन माइनस एक्स एंड देन होल पार फाइव लेफ्ट हैंड साइड इज एक्स पार फाइव Now using exponent loss, we can write minus one whole power five times one minus x whole power five. Now minus one whole power five is minus one, so I will write minus of one minus x whole power five. Take all the terms to LHS. X power five plus one minus x whole power five equal to zero. Now we will use substitution. Let us say one minus x equal to y. So one minus x equal to y. So the very first equation which we can write here, x power five plus y power five equal to zero. I will say this is equation one. Let's find out x plus y value. This will become x plus y is one minus x. So I'll write one minus x plus and minus x will be over. We will get one. So our second equation, which we will write, x plus y equal to one. Equation number two. Let me write here x power five plus y power five equal to zero. With x plus y equal to one, let's use binomial expansion. So I'll be writing x plus y whole power five using Pascal triangle. We know the expansion coefficients: one five, ten ten, five one. So I will write x power five plus y power five. Coefficient one is over plus five times x y. In the bracket, x cube plus y cube, coefficient five is over. Now coefficient ten, I will write ten times x square y square times x plus y. Now x plus y is one. So here I will write one. Left hand side I will write one power five. Let's write one power five equal to x power five plus y power five. This is zero. So I will write five times x y, then x cube plus y cube plus ten times x square y square, as x plus y is one. Now I can write one equal to five x y. Here I will use algebraic formula a cube plus b cube. It is a plus b whole cube. Minus three ab a plus b. So in place of a and b, x and y is there. So x plus y. Then we have ten times x square y square. Again, we'll put x plus y one. So one equal to five x y. One minus three x y. X plus y is one. Plus ten times. X square y square. Now I will simplify RHS. I will get 5 xy minus 15 x square y square plus 10 x square y square. So I can write minus 5 x square y square. Left hand side is 1. Now take all the terms to LHS. So equation will become 5 x square y square minus 5 xy plus 1. Equal to zero. This is one quadratic equation in x y. Let me write here five x square y square minus five x y plus one equal to zero. I will use quadratic formula. So we can write x y will be equal to as per formula. Minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac 
over 2 times a. Here a is 5, b is negative 5, c is 1. Let's put the values. xy will be equal to 5 plus minus the square root of minus 5 a square is 25 minus 4 ac so minus 20 over 2 times 5 10 will be there. This will be equal to 5 plus minus a square root of 5 over 10. This is the value of x y. Now I will write our second equation. Second equation was x plus y equal to 1. So from this equation I can write y equal to 1 minus x which we will apply here. So I can write x times 1 minus x equal to 5 plus minus square root 5 over 10. Or we can write x minus x square equal to 5 plus minus square root 5 over 10. Take all the terms to RHS. We will get quadratic equation as x square minus x plus 5 plus minus square root 5 over 10 equal to 0. Now we will apply quadratic formula once again. Here a is coefficient of x square. So I will write 1. B is coefficient of x minus 1. C is constant 5 plus minus square root 5 over 10. So x will become 1 plus minus square root of minus 1 square is 1 minus 4 times 1 times 5 plus minus square root 5 over 10 over this is b square minus 4ac now 2a in the denominator so i will write 2 now we have to simplify 1 plus minus square root of we will cancel 4 over 10 so it will be 2 over 5 so i will write 1 minus 2 times 5 plus minus square root 5 over 5 and then in the denominator it is 2 so i can write here over 2 in next step i will split our denominator 2 so i will write 1 over 2 plus minus 1 over 2 with a square root of 1 minus i will write 2 times 5 plus minus square root 5 over 5 now we will take LCM. Let me write this equation here. So x will be equal to 1 by 2 plus minus 1 by 2. Once we will take LCM, we will get common denominator 5. And then I will write 5 minus 10 and then minus plus 2 root 5. Or we can write 1 over 2 plus minus 1 over 2 square root of 5 minus 10 is minus 5 minus plus 2 square root 5 over 5. Or we can write half plus minus half square root of. Let's take minus common or minus 1 common. So in the bracket we will write 5 plus minus 2 root 5 over 5. Now we can write half plus minus half square root of negative 1 square root of 5 plus minus 2 square root 5 over 5. Now we know that square root of negative 1 is 
complex number i. So we will get half plus minus i over 2. So x equal to half plus minus i over 2 the square root of 5 plus minus 2 root 5 over 5. Or we can write x equal to half plus minus i over 2 and then we can divide the square root of 5 over 5 is 1 plus minus 2 square root 5 over 5. So here we have four complex solutions. If I will write in the split form then I can write here. Here we have all four complex solutions. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.